hello friends welcome to my channel in this video i am going to discuss introduction to bertrand russell and his writing style and his essays are also included in your slippers so to understand that essays you must understand their writing style of russell and how it is portrayed in his writing so without wasting time let's get begin by a brief introduction of russell right bertrand arthur william russell is full name right and he was the third all of russell and born on 18 may 1872 in the non mount shire the united kingdom and he was born in a british aristocratic liberal family and uh, he was a british logician philosopher historian mathematician essayist writer Uh, political activist social critic and nobel laureate as well so he he regarded himself as a socialist pacifist and social activist as well and uh, in the early decade of 20th century russell initiated and directed the revolt against idealism and he is regarded as a premier logician of 20th century and apart from this he is he was a leading anti war activist right and uh, so his writing include uh, anti war he write on the anti war and we'll see in his essays the future of mankind ideas that have harm mankind and ideas that have help mankind these are three of his essays you will discuss in your slippers uh, right i'll discuss them in detail as well so uh, right and he spotted anti imperialism or anti war his ideas he was a social reformer as well and uh, he was uh, given uh, awarded nobel prize in literature in 1950 for his writings right where he support human humanism humanitarian standards of freedom of expression and thought right and his um his attempts to uh, uh attend peace during war and uh, so this is about his early life his family life right and in his teenage russell often suffer from the spasm uh, of the seclusion loneliness due to which he attempts suicide right and he got education at home different tutors receive formal education from any institute and apart from that we'll discuss his uh, literary style his writing style so russell russell is a prolific prose writer and he his works deals with the diverse subjects of human interest right humanism focus on humanism right love for humans he's anti war and he love humans he love peace he is a social reformer and uh, his works deals with the problems of philosophy morality ethics social life politics economics and such other problems right and he he has a rich knowledge his opinions are honest and russell writes systematically and he communicates his ideas with power of writing in a unique influential and logical style and russell focuses on the fluency of expression clarity of thought and he he always states clear thoughts in pure lucid and transparent uh, style and uh, his charming style was developed through his neatness of expression and clarity of thought as well and his writing is not ornamental with the javel phrases or fanciful words right rather it's simple and he has an intellectually brilliant style right and he can easily string ideas into a few words that is brevity or laconic you can say expressing your thoughts using very few words right without using clarity his language is direct lucid means bright uh, clear simple direct right and then the precise usage of word precise and exact usage of words in his writing and uh, he uses rich clear transparent and pure words and his writing have no obscurity of ambiguity and uh, he does not use irrelevant or excessive words right use of thought and he masters the principle of unity of thought 
and uh, he begins his argument from the well studied assumption and then proceeds to logical conclusions step by step for apart from that his uh, every essay is logical and thoughtful and there is a coherence in his arguments and then elongated sentence he used long sentences right to maintain unity of thought russell used elongated lengthy elaborate sentences his thoughts are fluent coherent and rhythmic and apart from this simplicity of language used simple language and due to simplicity of his employed language that make his writing pleasant and sweet not dull and boring and his simple mode of expression made it easy for the readers even for the common man layman to understand his writing seriousness yes uh, he discuss on serious subject uh, for example war in his essays right and uh, he preserved the seriousness and then apart from that uh, he felt deeply for the suffering and problems of humanity so humanism is found love for humanity and philosophy of life love for life and uh, <coughs> and uh, broad mindedness and intellectual vision impersonal attitude to the problems of humans and his profound look on life anti war activism focuses on the weakness of human rights seriousness and sincerity of his style right and then humor and satire so it is also marked with humor cheerfulness and satire as well and his writing has a humorous touch with intellectual and scholarly style and it continued to appear lively and optimistic and uh, his humor uh, as a as a function of reformation he was a social reformer you know and his decorative style is brevity and clarity and uh, the many of his works are argumentative thoughtful in nature and he describes the history of his life and narrates it in a simple attractive and appealing manner and lack of symbolism right there is no metaphoric or symbolic language he used just simple and direct language and profundity in his thought he used deep thoughts in simple language and uh, he appears to be proper of having deep meanings right uh, for example in his essays he write pride of a race is even more harmful than the national pride and then extreme hopes in in his essay the future of mankind he write that extreme hopes are born of extreme misery and russell also used quotations from shakespeare bible greek and roman writers as well and his elegance grand style russell has mastery in conveying philosophical and technical ideas in an impressive manner his smooth effortless impressive style is proof of his elegant style and uh, he achieves this style by logical reasoning offering common examples to explain his ideas as well and uh, apart from that uh, he also illustrate the idea of how centuries old superficial beliefs have dominated the mind of a man and russell never gives any statement with abstract ideas or philosophy rather he is exact right he always give concrete examples to illustrate his point of view right and apart from that these statements most of his time produce striking effect on the readers right and his uh, liberal philosophy right he does not have any prejudice or personal likes and dislike right rather he love humanity his ideas are universal or humanistic and he does not follow any any trend and his philosopher who always preaches a scientific temper of mind his open mindedness his broad ideas universality his views on the variety of topics such as economics politics ethics psychology morality education skepticism civilization communism uh, peace war government politics as well so this is about russell and in upcoming videos i'll discuss his ss